Have you ever wondered, what is it like to be on a film set? What does it look like? Is it glamorous? What is that food like? What is that craft services I always hear so much about? No? No. Never, never wondered that? No, not at all. Well, I'm just gonna tell you anyway. What does it look like? Well, it mostly looks like a bunch of guys in black Arc'teryx coats and Blundstone boots. Is it glamorous? I know. And what is the food like? What is craft services like? Well, that, that all depends. It depends a lot on what craft truck you have because some of them are really good and some of them are not so good. And lunchtime, a catered lunch, well, that, those, those are almost never good. I mean, if, if you've had a good catered lunch on set, let me know because I'm very curious. <laughs> but you can fill up on craft truck because a lot of the time they come to play and the food is pretty good. So I'm just gonna bring you to set. So join me, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna show you a few days worth of you know breakfast and snacks that you can have on the craft truck. All right, we are on location. <laughs> Before I even have my breakfast, I'm going to We'll have a coffee and oat milk, but also they make freshly baked croissants. I mean, come on, straight out of the oven, like this is warm. And I heard they're making like a nice frittata for breakfast. They also make um, really good like overnight oats with fresh ingredients or yogurt parfaits. Like theirs are just the best. Anyway, I'm gonna eat this right now. Today on the menu is a veggie frittata and hash browns. Looks quite nice, no? Let's see. Let's get the little taste. Uh, tomato, onion, spinach, frittata. Ah! It's just nice and simple and delicious. Ooh, thank you. Oh. Something that we will have to get. Thank you. Beautiful. So delicious. Can you tell me a little bit about uh, what's in this Buddha bowl? We're enjoying their bowls today. Yeah. We've got a Buddha bowl on today. It's with a quinoa base, sweet potato, peppers, chickpeas, lime pickled onion, a touch of lime wedges, mojo sauce, oh. cherry tomatoes, pickled radishes, the piece of uh, of resistance this is resistance. the feta sour cream. Oh, Pickled that's what it is. Cauliflower, chia oh. seeds, and avocado. Oh, oh amazing. Yeah. Amazing. It. It's Enjoy. delicious. It crafty. Yeah. Crafty, it's the best friend. craft truck. Best you. craft truck in town. Okay, I have a quick note. So you'll notice that, you know, sometimes I, in this video I'm having a little snack. And maybe you can just like, sometimes you just grab a little bag of chips or an apple or like a different snack. And then sometimes you notice that I have these like little mini meals. It's not breakfast and it's not lunch, but it's called a sub, which that stands for a substantial. So it's, you know, a more substantial snack basically. Um, and you might think like, wow, why are they always giving so much food away on Saturday? Like, 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 you know, most jobs, they're not just like constantly being like, hey, like it's regulated, it's time for like a meal and blah, blah, blah. But think about it, you're not allowed to leave. Like when you're on set, you're on set. So you don't have to have all the meals and the subs and the snacks, but they're available to you so you can keep working. And there's a lot of like, you get up early, it's strenuous work and it's just, it's a lot. So they have the food available and it's all part of like the union, how they have it regulated like every X amount of hours, they have to have X amount of food, so I just wanted to let you know that so you understand why there's all these other little meals among the meal meals. Get it? Got it? Good. What's the sub? We got Big Mac poutine. Whoa. <laughs> mm. Cheese sauce. Does it sauce? taste like a Big Mac? It tastes like a Big Mac. It tastes exactly like a Big Mac. Wow. That's crazy. On fries. It's amazing. Amazing. Hi there. What are we having for lunch today? We've got a vegan Buddha bowl. Vegan Buddha bowl? Yeah. They actually. <laughs> <laughs> they actually. <laughs> by the way, did you know that they didn't actually have the vegan Buddha bowl and what you're eating is something else? Oh, yeah. I mean, I wouldn't really. It's not very specific. <laughs> it's just a bunch of mush. That's what I got too. What did you get? 
Oh, wait, did you get the chicken surprise? Chicken, what was it called? Chicken Supreme. Supreme. And what exactly is? It's, uh, what is it? It looks like a, it's like a chicken breast um, with, uh, uh, I think it's a poblano, uh, it's like a pepper sauce. Hmm. Pepper cream sauce. It's actually And no out of 10? I give it like a six and a half. That's actually higher than like I would seven, have expected. Even. Wow. Yeah. And it's for no you? Bad. It's really no I bad. mean, this is like a soft six. A soft six? What? Changes the game is their little hot sauce. Oh, the oh the homemade hot sauce, right? So we have two of these on there, and it, and it elevates it to yeah. a firm. A AKA it makes and, it tolerable. But also, Pat should mention his uh, <laughs> 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 This is the this is the real get... kicker. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a large human hair. Oh wow! Yeah. You know what? You I'm, I'm got, not, it's the noodle surprise. Yeah, yeah. I'm, that, I'm, the you're the winner. I'm not going to eat it. <laughs> that's the surprise of the noodle. Surprise. The noodle surprise. Yeah, well, was, bon appetit. Yeah. Here Thank we go. You. This is the unboxing. This is what an on-set lunch looks like. It's beautiful. I don't know. Does this look appetizing on camera? I mean, we're sitting in literal trash. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that doesn't help. <laughs> oh yeah, and the falafel balls. And I went for the Caesar salad. To remind you of the potatoes and the cake? They remind me of like what you see in a commercial of like, oh, it's like bad lunch lady like slop. Yeah. Like this could be, this is like. <laughs> oh my God, it's like freaking hot. She has a pimple on her face and you sick lunch bowl. It tastes better than it looks, so I'll give it that. Do you like when the skins are in the mashed potatoes? Yes, but not too much. That was a, qu a quick answer, well, yes. Yeah, I mean, it's just another element. I, I mean, for texture? I mean, I'm a texture person. It's nice to have a little bit of a bite. A little color hit, a little curly color hit. Mm -hmm. This is like a, it's a very- It's very creamy. There's definitely dairy. There's a lot. <laughs> I'm also, I don't know, call me crazy. <laughs> is there a hit of coconut? You know what? It's coconut milk because it's vegan. Yeah, that's what it is. That's what it is. Yeah. So maybe they're onto something with these coconut. I actually like that little hit of coconut, but I could see people not liking it. Oh. Uh, well, I'm just gonna take off. What are you uh, moving on to? We're looking more like yeah. earlier than that. I do find that if you let your cake sit in the hot sun on the asphalt, it becomes warm just like it's fresh out of the oven. Pro tip. The cookies are good. Do you like the regular one better or the double I chocolate? I ate them so fast, I don't even know. It all tastes the same. <laughs> I think the chocolate chip is better. Chocolate chip is always better. So today, I went for, I thought I was going to get the like healthier option, went for the Buddha bowl, and then I stuck my, fing, my finger, my fork in, and for some reason <laughs> there's a layer of mashed potatoes along the bottom. It's filler. So it looked like a big bowl of quinoa and vegetables, but it's just like set dress on top. So what is this beautiful, delicious looking breakfast? It's shakshuka, which is basically eggs that are poached in like a tomato stew. Okay, they're shooting like a fake, uh, they're shooting a fake club scene down there, so it's all like lighting and like music, and then like emerging out into the sun. Reminds me of my past and, you know, leaving some crazy party and it's daylight. Triggering, anyway. I must say, getting to go to different locations when you're on set can be a lot of fun. I can't remember exactly what this was, but it's some sort of meat on a really flaky pastry. And I remember it was really flaky because the seagulls were 
reaping the benefits. Oh wow, it looks really good. Hey, I'll park. Can you go to so it's pouring rain, it's been raining, it's a miserable day, but it's time for the sub, the afternoon, evening sub. And it is, wait for it, it's kind of intense. Kimchi fries, whoa, kimchi fries with fried egg and duck coffee. Like, that's kind of insane, no? So I could go on and on and just keep showing you more and more footage of what I eat on set, but I just wanted to give you a little taste, yes, a taste of what we eat on set um, on the regular. Um, it seems like we eat a ton of food, but yeah, honestly, we have a little breakfast, a little sub snack in the morning, lunch, and another sub in the afternoon. You work long hours, you deserve some good food. So I hope you learned a little bit of something from this, and I appreciate you tuning in, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.